What you have to do at one million dollars, everybody is winging it. Everybody on the team is essentially winging it. At ten million dollars, you're not winging it anymore. Every call that you run follows a form, what we call an, a, a blueprint. We're going to open the call. Following the opening on the call, we're going to run an ace. I'm going to explain to you what it is in a second. We're going to run the agenda. We're going to perform the call, whatever it is, demo, disco. We're going to close it, which we call a wagons. Then we're going to you know, push through to the next steps, action. Okay. Most people, when they're running a call, and they say, like, hey, Jocko, how do I make my win ratio increase? We go, like, look, do this. Do this and you'll succeed. Open up the call. During the first two minutes of the call, many say, hey, we need to have a little chit chat. Yes, but there's a reason why you have that chit chat. That chit chat is so you understand who is the decision maker on the call and what their voice sounds like and who is the technical voice and what their sound voice sounds like. You need to lock those. You need to learn it during the opening of the call. So when the person speaks to you, you know that this person you know, of authority, if they're just purely interested or if this is what they're responsible for. After that, let's say two minutes, you run an ace. Appreciate you time. Appreciate you folks taking the time today. May I ask, are we still good till the top of the hour? You check the end time. Appreciate A, check the end time, C. And then we set the end goal. If I may, if I understand correctly, you're looking to learn if we are a good fit. At the end of this call, if you deem we're a good fit, we'd like to move forward with a demo, a proposal, the next steps. Do you agree what the end goal is? At the end of this call, we're moving forward with disco demo, but whatever it is, angle. Okay. This ace sets up the call. We come back to that at the end. At the end, I'm asking folks, during today's call, did you learn what you've learned? Yes. Do you, at the beginning of the call, we said that if you got these answers to this, you would ready to move forward. Are you ready to move forward? Yes. It looks and it connects and connects and moving forward. What do we do here in the middle? In the middle, we perform the call. Now, in the discovery, I may separate that in the diagnosis of three things, three situations, three particular pains that they're having, three particular issues that they want to solve. And during the demo, I may separate them in three particular demonstrations I want to have. I call these things compartments. This is not one thing. What happens when, you know, when the ship doesn't have compartments and it gets hit you know, by an iceberg, for example? One compartment, it floods, it sinks. Therefore, we create three compartments. That means if, if two of your demo pieces or two of your discoveries went right, but only one didn't, you're still afloat. If you miss all three of them, obviously that is not good, but even if you only hit one, you can still have a good call. You compartmentalize. That means as you discuss the agenda, you say, today I'm gonna to go to this, number one, number two, and number three on the agenda. You close each topic at the end of that as you move forward. This, all this combined, improves. In this case, as Jonas has asked, this is how you improve CR4, which is your win rate. Okay? What these two things do, ACE and wagons, they shorten your sales cycle. They bring what we call T4 from 28 days to 26 days or 24 days. They reduce it by 5 or 10%. T4, by setting this up correctly, ACE and wagons, we're shortening it up. By providing a proper diagnosis and demonstration, we're increasing your conversion rate. Do you see how that starts to work? Science behind it. You write this down. At $1 million, the superstars are winging it. At $10 million, we're listening to the superstars. We're copying and pasting this. We're creating a framework and we're letting everybody else use this. And at the same time, we gather them on Friday for one hour. We listen to a few legally correctly recorded calls. We listen to these calls and we compare. Did they do this right? Did this happen right? How did the demo go? We learn, we improve, we learn, we improve. And slowly but surely, CR4, which was the win rate, goes from one in five to one in whatever, four and a half to one in four. We slowly but surely improve. By doing that, that minor upgrade right then and there, that is how we're starting to improve our sales.